Hey everybody, this is an update video on my jeweled Lacertas. Um, as you know, I used to have two jeweled Lacertas, but one of them had always had a neurological problem. It couldn't really eat. Um, I had to hand feed it since it was a little baby. Could never actually catch its own prey, even just mealworms sitting in a dish. Uh, that was Chansey. Uh, Chansey ended up having uh, extreme spinal swelling and passing away about six months ago now. Uh, this is the other baby jeweled Lacerda I raised from a hatchling. This is Onyx. As you can see, Onyx is just about picture perfect of what you expect from a jeweled Lacerda. They're a little skittish, but I don't want him to go into his hide. I just want him to stop and say hello. There we go, buddy. Give me another lick. For the most part, he's pretty relaxed. Uh, he's really, really big. I mean... From head to tail, he's probably almost 18 inches. I mean, he's got a big, huge, thick, beautiful tail. Awesome, awesome coloring. Uh, you can see he just busted another shed not too long ago. Uh, beautiful, beautiful phosphorescent blue dots on the side of his body. Nice checkered green pattern. They almost have that leathered skink head to them. Uh, this is actually probably one of my most favorite lizards in my collection right now. For the most part, as long as I let him lick me and he knows it's me, he's perfectly fine with letting me pet him. Uh, he doesn't particularly like to be handled too much. I do pick him up every once in a while. As you can see, his setup is a 40-gallon breeder. Uh, he has a heated hide, of course, with a heating mat under it to keep it nice and toasty, especially since uh, it can get chilly down in my cellar during the winter times. I've had Onyx now for about three years. Uh, this is He's a good-sized lizard. He's given us a nice, beautiful look at his long, awesome body right now. And like I said, he's just... Probably a prime example of how beautiful a jeweled Lacerda could be. Um, now, a lot of people don't know that jeweled Lacerdas aren't just strictly protein. you got to give them nice salads. Uh, they like sweet fruit. He always eats his greens. Right now, he's got some chicory in there. Uh, I give him mustard greens, dandelion greens, collard greens, uh, shredded carrot, and uh, chopped up bell pepper. Those are usually the different mixtures I like to give our little guy here. Now, as you can see, he's just absolutely perfect and beautiful. Uh, they have like an armored plated belly that they kind of slide around on. They do like the burrow with a little bit. I have a mixture of uh, play sand and coconut fiber in this enclosure. Uh, nice little water dish. I got a UVB bulb and I have a 100, and 100 watt basker in here. And uh, the 100 watt basker is right above his hide. So if he wants to climb to the top of his hide, he can do some hot basking. Uh, besides that, I've had Onyx now for almost three years. I've raised him since he was a hatchling, no bigger than my pinky finger. Uh, you can actually go see the videos where I had him delivered to me. And uh, yeah, Jewel Lacerda is absolutely awesome and beautiful. And if any, anybody's thinking about buying one or you're curious, they are awesome lizards. I mean, friendly. I can pick him up. He never tries to bite me ever. He'll just lick my finger, close his eyes, and let me pet him. Very sweet lizard. Good temperament. They can be skittish if you startle them, but for the most part, like I said, I just put them in there and let them get a good lick on my finger. As you see, the base of his tail is almost as fat as the middle of his body. That is just an awesome, gorgeous tail that just goes on forever. Uh, so, thank you guys for watching my update video. Thank you for checking out Onyx, my jeweled Lacerda. And once again, this is a 40-gallon breeder with a mix of play sand and coconut fire for, uh, fiber for substrate. Healthy green salad, water dish, a hide, which is heated underneath in case of chilly nights. And a, a phosphorescent bulb to give UVB light and a basking, intense basking light. And uh, this is my buddy Onyx, and thank you for watching the video.